Well, howdy, folks. It's me, Choppy Push Potato. Father, Choppy Push Potato. Today, we're going to be playing a little bit of Red Dead Redemption 2. So, I fancy playing this game for a long, long time. It's been probably like four years since I last played it. And, uh, yeah, basically, uh, it's like a movie, you know, it's just like, you know, when you get that urge to rewatch a really good movie, that's what I've got for Red Dead right now. I just need to experience it again, you know, and, um, you know, I figured it's such a cool game. And for anyone that hasn't experienced it or maybe can't bring themselves to play it, maybe you want to watch me play it. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Just sit back relax and uh, let's jump in to Red Dead Redemption 2 and for those of you wondering if you need to see or play Red Dead Redemption 1 first you don't Red Dead Redemption 1 is actually the sequel to Red Dead Redemption 2 because 2 is the prequel like it happens before the story of 2 uh, sorry of 1 so yeah this is actually the first one so it's better to actually I would say play this one first and then move on to the other one so yeah uh, my opinion but you know okay enough chatter let's hop on in so by 1899 the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end America was becoming a land of laws Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Our oh, hell. Rockstar Games presents. Red Dead Redemption 2. But yeah, seriously, this game is freaking awesome. It, it holds up so well as well. Because it's like, it's just got so many little unique and like, you know, details in it that just make it like replayable and everything. Oh, here we go. Shh, shh, shh. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Awesome. So I'm going to try and not talk while they're talking, just so you can hear everything. Because otherwise, when I talk, the volume of the game goes down slightly. So, yeah. So don't be worried. I'm still here. Chapter 1, Coulter. Bring him in here! Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, 
See what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we going to do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're going to stay here, and you were going to get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're going to ride out, see if we can find one of them. This? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. Oh, yeah. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors! I always remember. Sorry, the one thing I really love about this game is the snow physics. I don't know, just walking through the snow in this game is, like, so satisfying. I'm just going to make sure the audio is on max volume here. One second, voice chat, no... Uh, score dialogue balance. What's this? Control zero of, uh, of sounds and dialogue. So should maybe just turn dialogue up to the max as well, maybe. Or just put it here. Stereo, surround. Uh, let's just do headphones, maybe. No, let's keep it on stereo, whatever. Seems okay. Okay, hopefully the, the voices are a little bit louder now. We need you strong. Okay. Yeah, I think that's a bit louder. Look at the snow. All right, let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn. Oh, oh, oh. Wind. My horse. Days are more like this now. It has to blow over soon. Let's go. Ride him, cowboy. Take it easy. Ah, easy. Which way? That way? I can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Hey, what? I'm just going to whack the voices up to max. I think it will make it easier for everyone. About Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. Wait. Is that someone coming towards us? I don't see no one.
You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Ah, oh, Micah, eh? Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. <laughs> like a party. How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean. We don't know. Quite a business. Yep. I'm I love the graphics in this. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things <laughs> always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Uh, tap to move up. Okay. I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes some... Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Ah, oh, there it is. Gosh. I vaguely remember this, but not very well. It's been quite a long time. Okay. Let's head down there. Yep. Look at the snow, it's so good. It's just so so good. It's like in Poland at the moment, freaking snowing everywhere. It's been snowing all day today. Gotta to go out shopping soon as well. So that should be fun. Hopefully the car will start. Yeah, the atmosphere in this game is like top notch. And also, um, I will still be playing Cyberpunk. I just, uh, I really fancy playing Red Dead as well, to be honest. Approach the hitching post, okay. That's a hitching post, is it? Hold E. There you go. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. I draw something in the snow. Someone's having fun in there. I used to play this. Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. <laughs> in that cattle shed on the left. I could get down behind that wagon in front. <laughs> I used to play this on uh, PlayStation 4 with a controller, and it's quite good with a controller, but it seems quite decent on keyboard and mouse as well. I think aiming should be a lot easier, but my sensitivity is quite high at the moment, so I might need to turn that down a bit. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Shh. Excuse me? Hello? Oh, uh, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, train. we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. Now, I, I just Arthur. need... So, There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen, keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should. Hold tab to get the weapon wheel. Uh, okay, we're going for it, are we? Straight away. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am kind of desperate. Hey. I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here! 
It's goddamn over there! More of them! It's he was drawing his gun. On him. You sons of bitches! Oh. One of them's making a run for it. Arthur. Come here, boy. What if I catch him? Got him. Oh hell, Jimmy. Oh hell, Arthur Morgan, what you gone done? You gone shot him in the head, boy. That's my boy, Arthur. Good shooting. Goddamn a crystal boy is here. Anything in the outhouse? No. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go cabin. Oops, one button. What am I doing? Going in here. Can I loot these people or not? No. How do I put my weapon away? Oh, there we go. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need hey, let's grab supplies. Medicine. Whiskey. Poop cakes. Your health core drains. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Uh, looks like the poor bastard was married too. At some point. Hmm. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Okay, calm down. Calm down, Dutch, yeah? Just inspecting. Hold B to open your satchel. Eat a provision. Ah, oh, okay. Ah, oh, there we go. I remember now. So my health is that little heart at the bottom left, you can see. Oh, so, just see, just oh. going up. One more. It's a strange there we go. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big Same price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Martin Colm is dead. It's about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. Loads of stuff in here. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. I'm searching, I'm searching. In the box? No. Meet me out here when you're done. Lovely job, lady. Else. Oh, I didn't even notice that was there. I just sort of walked into it. Okay, let's take this. Revolver cartridges. Oat cakes. Lovely. Anything else? No. How did that guy get over there? Do you like jump across, did he, or something? I think I can. Okay, that's it. What's this? Gold pocket watch. So that I will sell. Horse card. Premium cigarettes. And two dollars. Lovely. I'm rich. Okay, I think that's everything. Micah, Arthur. Keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin. See huh. what you missed. Sure. Get the old gun out, just in case. <laughs> Something going on in here. What's that? Compass, expand, off. <laughs> he started it. Oh. 
What's going on? Now this guy just jumped me. Oh, oh, did he now? He did. Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Calm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Calm, O'Driscoll? Uh, with the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. Now, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. Hmm. I don't know anything else. <laughs> Choke, spare, beat. Let's just spare him, whatever. Get the hell out of here. We'll kill him later if needed. Pick up my gun. And my hat. Uh, hat. Oh, there we go. Focus on the horse. Okay. Easy. It's okay. Easy. You're okay. Hell yeah. Good boy. Horse bonding achieved. Come here, Mr. Horse. That's a nice horse. You'll come in with me, good sir. On an adventure. You let him go, huh? So all the little bastards scurrying off. Yeah. Figured he won't get far in this anyway. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Tie him up over there, Arthur. Okay. I will. Thank you. Get away from me! Michael, what the hell do you think you're doing? Why up there, you? Leave her alone! I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh, you fool. Oh, Micah. You silly sausage. Now, it is going to be okay. We mean you. No harm. Miss! Miss! Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. Oh. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are Gosh. safe now. And you can't stay here. I wish I killed that guy now. Come with us. Arthur. Yes. It's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. <laughs> it's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. 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 Mrs. He... He was my husband. Hey! Somebody's coming! Don't shoot, it's, it's me. Nice. Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets. A little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? 
And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself oh. bed. Yikes. You can't be saying that, my friend. That's how you get cancelled. Uh, yes. Save. So that was like the intro. Hope you enjoyed. Yeah, story story on this game is amazing. Like so good. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got <laughs> himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Thank you. <sighs> This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. So, fun fact. Not a spoiler, really. But, um... John Marston, the guy we're looking for now, he's actually the protagonist of the first game. So... In Red Dead Redemption 1, you, you play as John, whereas in this one, you play as Arthur. And they're both, like, epic characters. I think, if I had to choose, I think Arthur is a little bit cooler. Come on. But John's pretty badass as well. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Come on, boy. There's some tracks leading to the river. Inspect. Two hours ago, most. Let's cross. Hey, let's go. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but. Could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. <laughs> Take it slow. Big ravine here. Big ravine, eh? Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> Tracks go left, down here. Let's go, let's follow these tracks. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Oh yeah, I forgot this cinematic camera in this, so you can like make it like a movie. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Oh. Hey, 
Ah! My horse is going crazy. Oh my god, how do I get rid of this? There we go. Okay, need to get used to the camera again. Watch yourself, it's not very wide here. I'll be fine. Come on. Look at my horse, my horse is amazing. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on now. Come on, Mr. Horse. You can do it. Over there. You see that? See something. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Oh, yeah. Let's see if he can hear us. He's over there. Come on! Up there! That horse ain't looking too good. It's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. I have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Uh, shotgun. Who's what's up ahead? Come on. Okay. Sure about this. Over here. Ah. It's coming from this way. Okay. Watch out. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Help me. Stamina is displayed. Bottom right. Oh, I need to get my stamina back. Um Health stamina, greed, illusion, blah blah blah. Probably beans still do Watch stamina. Yourself. There we go. It's slippery. Be careful. I'll be careful. Don't worry. Watch Wee. the here. Okay, from here. Watch your step. What? Stay close to the wall. Up How did here. my stamina just go? Come I just on. refilled it. Gap here. Over here. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Take a drink of that. Thanks. Thank you. I shall. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? Marston! John, where are you? John, you there? Over here. Down on the ledge. That's John. We're coming. I'm down here. Where are you, John? Fellas there! Alright! Hot down, Marston! He's down here. That's quite a scratch you got there. Oh dear. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You too, John Marston. You don't look so good. 
I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Compadre. I am the padre. Padre Potato. I think another reason I wanted to play this game can't go back the way we came. Let's try this is, way. is because I'm watching Yellowstone at the moment. And you know, it's all about cowboys sort of thing, so I'm just in the in the cowboy mood. You weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You alright? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Oh dear. Look up there. Are they wolves or coyotes or what? Probably wolves in this kind of snow. Go. Draw them off. Okay. Okay. Go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Uh, hold R to attract. Okay. We'll get you out of here. Over here. Uh oh. Oh. There we go. Easy. Only got bitten twice. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. Let's go, let's go. Come on then, let's get back to the others. Let's roll. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a a dog bite. <sighs> you knew a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. You ain't gonna <laughs> die. Not yet. Up there! Four of them! Oh god. Go! Get the hell out of here! Get out! Oh, shit, there's more. Oh wow, look at him. He flew. Oh, ran over him. <laughs> yeah. See more, Don't think so. Jesus. You still they didn't even get a touch. Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us <laughs> are lucky right now. John is the lucky one, that's for sure. Good old Lucky John. John Lad. For a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're going to need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. <laughs> Let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Oh. Back to camp. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Right, here we go. There we go. Oh. Ah, you oh. careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh. Idiotas. Let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, <laughs> even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? 
I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west <laughs> is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> There we go. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Okay. Oh, yeah, you can view the journal entries as well. So, this journal, like, um,. As you do the story, he'll obviously fill it out, but also um, any like side quests or interesting people you meet, he'll also put it in here so you can like update the journal as you go sort of thing. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And the way it works here is, um, so when you go to sleep in your room, so this is our room at the moment, you can open a drawer and there'll be like supplies in here that you can just take uh, and you know eventually you get into much nicer places because this isn't the nicest place to be in but you know so, why can't I take that I can't take any more I don't know what it is but whatever How you feeling, Jose? You've been coughing a lot. That's the cold. Thank you for bringing John back. Of course. Okay there, Dutch? Thank you. Thank you for bringing John back. Finally, some relief. He's beat up, but he'll be all right, I hope. And uh, I think you can build like better relationships by talking to players, uh, like characters, along the journey. Morning. If I remember. I much warmer this morning. Up the morning here. I think she's Irish. God, that was a terrible Irish accent. But yeah, apologies to all my Irish friends back in Cork. Okay, so this is like the camp now. And on the map, you can see those little yellow blobs. So they're like the quests that you can do. So we can head over and do this quest here, maybe. Stay alert there, Javier. Another cold morning. <laughs> that it is. Okay, boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. But fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> a party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it now. You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. Bushwhack. I know you bushwhack. Him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You. You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you... My fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah! 
And off we go. Got a lasso. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. You said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this core they're planning. And the whole thing isn't set in the snow, just so you know. You do get out of the snow eventually and like... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Horse going crazy. There we go. What's that? Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest one way or another. It will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. <laughs> yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Whoa. So the O'Driscolls are like the main bad guys in this, if I remember rightly. All right, gentlemen, this is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're going to head up here a little. See if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. There they are. Uh, that's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. <laughs> Come on, let's get down there. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Search horse and hold tab. Them all from up there. You got it, Dutch. Good. Okay. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just... Wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. We'll be fine, don't you worry. Oh, 
One, two, three, four. At least four. Oh, watch out. It's a bit steep. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Get the rifle out. Seven shots. That will be plenty. If I hit, stay low. Come on, follow me. Okay, let's get in cover. <laughs> that feller smacked you up something stupid, huh? Yeah, I showed that bastard. So, left him in the dirt what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Uh, take the lead. Let's do it. Okay, I'll go first. So why they let you go? So I wouldn't have done. Feller didn't have much choice. Was picking his teeth off the floor. Yeah. Oh, Driscolls! You sons of bitches! Oh. Headshot. Oh, this one there. Boom, headshot. Anyone else in here? Oh, shot his hat off. Oh, a headshot. This is gonna be real easy for me. Boom. Any more? There's one over there. Sorted. Search the bodies. Strip everything we can from them. You recognize any of them, Dutch? Of course not. Cole doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought, you're in. Think how long some of you have been with me. I imagine Cole doesn't even know half the names of these fools. Looting like ammo and health and. Everything. More of the bastards coming out of the trees. Oh. There's more. And this mar. See anyone? Oh, press to enable dead eye. Uh, Pick them off as they come out of the 
trees. Don't lose them. them in the trees. Ah! I can't see any of them. Oh, this one. Okay, there we go. I forgot about the dead eye thing that's awesome so it's like matrix style it like slows the time down and then you can just like place your cursor wait or your crosshair where you want to shoot and then when you click fire you just like open fires like really fast kind of thing pretty cool Okay. I won't spend too much time because it's mostly just ammo that these guys have, so it's no point. Get over here. I'm here, I'm here. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Oh, dynamite. Nice. Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount oh, Mr. Cornwall. Let's keep moving. All right, let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All God of you. damn it. Not a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pull mm -hmm. us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Yeehaw. So back to camp we go and uh, after this mission I'll probably stop and keep it there because that'll be an hour that we've been playing so see that fella? wasn't he at the camp with Colm? leave him to me oh right. we're heading back just bring him back I'll have to chase him do I okay you got it now come on chase down oh lasso him uh okay there we go yeah Let's do it. Let's lasso this Plonkosaurus. Get away from me! Not so fast, there. There we go. Ah, no. Get down there. You're coming with me. Please, please, you don't need to do this. I do. You don't understand. I really do need to do it. 
because the story won't progress if I don't. Oh, it just got dark really fast. Okay, put him on my horse. You got me mixed up with someone else. No, I didn't. Let's go. Which way? What's your name, boy? That away. I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Mm -hmm. What are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I advise <laughs> you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! I like Arthur Morgan. He's got like a dark sense of humour. He's a cheeky chap. That's no, what we like. Please. I'm begging you. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. <laughs> Tell me nothing. I swear. Please. I swear. Oh, dang it easy. You're going to break my ribs. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. <laughs> Legend. Nice and cozy. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. The boys. Okay. Come here, Mr. Kieran. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. <laughs> you found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. And feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out. What you need. I can't believe it! Mm -hmm. Driscoll in my camp! I ain't an old Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son! Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Alrighty. Cool. So I think that's the end of that quest, I think. Yeah. Cool. Mission complete. Old friends. So, that was... Uh, you okay, Bill? Are we gonna hit this train then? Seems that way. So that was uh, the little introduction to Red Dead Redemption 2 and Arthur Morgan. So, yeah. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you want me to keep recording this uh, playthrough as well. Guess that worked out, the old Driscolls. Now we just have to rob the train to get out of here. Yeah, but them wagons are still snowed in. You having fun in here, Lenny? More since we robbed the old Driscolls. <laughs> Hopefully we'll be out of here soon. Okay, cool. So I will leave it at that. Um, yeah, leave a comment, a like, a dislike, whichever you fancy, and uh, stay tuned for the next episode, I guess. Um, but yeah, I'll probably be jumping between this and Cyberpunk from time to time. Um, so I'll have like two series on the go, but uh, yeah, I figured these are two nice story-driven games. Both quite different, obviously, but yeah. So thank you very much for watching. 
Um, I think it saves automatically, so I should be good just to quit. I think. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so thank you very much. I've been Sharpie Puss Priest Father Potato. God be with you, and um, stay tuned for next time. <laughs>